Wonderful Man. Welcome back to this weekly vlog. It looks nice and sunny today, but it's actually really, really cold. But it should be nice and hot and sunny by the, the weekend. I think it's supposed to get to like 20 degrees, which is great. That's what I'm looking forward to. So I'm making my way down Oxford Street as, as always to work. And it's Tuesday, so I'm going to be heading into Primark, of course. I'm still looking for the flounder bag. It is still not there, but it should be arriving this week. So I'm gonna be in there like every day in the morning just to make sure that I get it. Don't forget to give this a big thumbs up, like, subscribe, and all that stuff. Comment below as you're going through this video if there's anything you would like to comment on. Also, the Disney store in Oxford Street, I just need to show you the window because it's amazing. They've now got the pumpkin carriage in the window. It's really cool, I like how they've done it. So it looks like there's a huge pumpkin on the outside. You're just gonna get a lot of my reflection. But the pumpkin is on the outside like this. And then when you go inside, the carriage is there. And the trailer is there. I love this, it's cool. I might head in there on my lunch break just to check it out. Cause it's down downstairs, it's gonna be different now without the pumpkin carriage down there, so yeah. Interesting, I want to see what it looks like. Oh my god, I look really, really tired. I'm really annoyed with myself because you know that song? Take me down to the paradise city where the grass is green and the girls are pretty. That song, yeah. I've managed to get that stuck in my head. But I don't know the, all, all the words, so it's literally just that little bit. Oh, won't you please take me home? Finished up in Primark and there's still no flounder bag, so. I will be back again tomorrow. It's my lunch break, so I'm making my way to the Disney store. Okay, here we go. Cinderella's carriage. Well, Cinderella's pumpkin. And there's Cinderella's carriage. Ta -da. It's pretty cool. Okay, so let's check out what downstairs looks like now. Now that it's all gone. There's gonna be a lot of space down there, I bet. Oh, wow, it looks so different. It looks huge. So there's a whole lot of space now. Love. All of this, all my Disney range. Yes, 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 yes. Oh my god, they got a new Rapunzel here. Which is cute. I haven't seen Rapunzel before. I mean, obviously I've seen Rapunzel, but I haven't seen this Rapunzel. She's cool, very cool. Right, so basically it's really spacious down here now. That they've moved the carriage upstairs, but definitely make sure you come and snap and share in the carriage. Okay, back to work. And the blog post that I wrote for Camellia is now like officially online, so. Yay! I'm gonna put a link in the description down below. I know I did it for the last weekly vlog, but it's actually live now, so I'm really excited about it. But yeah, check it out if you haven't already. It's awesome! I'm so exhausted. I was up until like half 12 last night because I was in that editing mood. And so I just edited and edited and edited until it was half 12. Now it's 7 a.m. and I'm on my way to work and I'm tired. I'm tired. It's my lunch break, it's raining, but I am on my way to H&M. I want a top or something for my Milo bound, so I'm going to see if they've got anything there. I'm still very, very tired from my late night, but the day's almost over and the week is almost over. Silver linings. I decided to go for Forever 21 instead and they actually have a load of stuff on sale right now, so I might have to go back when I'm not on my lunch break so that I've got more time. I guess one good thing about fan days is that it's in June, so I've got plenty of time. I have a whole month, I'll be fine. I'll manage to get everything I need to get, I'm sure. I mean, I've already got the trousers, I've ordered the boots. It's all gonna be good. It'll come together nicely, I hope. Wednesday's finished and I'm very, very excited because hump day is over, that means we are all the way through, almost all the way through the week and the weekend is only a couple of days away. I've got us tickets this weekend to the DC Superheroes exhibition at the O2 Center. 
O2 Center, O2 Arena, O2 Arena. So I'm gonna check that out and see what that's all about and share it with you guys. So last week was all marvel and this weekend is gonna be very DC. And I'm absolutely, definitely looking forward mostly to Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. Who's your favorite character from the DC universe? TV, movie, whatever. Mine is Wonder Woman or Superman. I kind of can't really tell. It's one or the other, probably Wonder Woman, but yeah. Uh, who's your favorite? Comment below and let me know. I also love Arrow, so yeah, I don't know. Back home on Wednesday, I haven't done very much. I've just rearranged the bedroom. So I now have my Mickey memory stuff up here. And over here, I've got this little section of the room with my Craig and Greg married Mickey thing. That picture from when I proposed. Keys. Frame with another key. And yeah, that's about it. That's what I've done. I've done some dusting. Not very exciting, but I am super tired as I was up until like one. Did I say one this morning? Whatever I said this morning, that's how long I was up. I've had a sleeping pill now, Sominex, <laughs> and I'm gonna get a nice early night. So, good night, I will see you tomorrow. Hopefully the flounder bag is in Primark. It's supposed to be in this week. I'm gonna check every day until it's there. Praying it's there. Nope, nope, no way, nope, nope. You'd never get me doing that, nope. There is a man or two inside there. Nope, 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 nope. No, no, I don't even feel comfortable standing underneath it. No, it's Thursday, the weekend is almost here. I started watching this like crime thing about something dust, someone dust. I love crime shows, so I was looking for like good ones to watch. There was a, there was a movie with Kirsten Dunst. She did a movie about something to do with this. I can't remember what it was. Anyway, there's this like serial killer. I don't know if he's a serial killer, he's a murderer. Fascinating, I find it fascinating. So yeah, I'm watching this. I don't know how many parts it is, but I just found it on Daily Motion. So yeah, that'll do. Okay, flounder bag. Come on, flounder bag. Still no flounder bag at Primark, but good news. The vape is really working. I've not smoked for a while now, so this is great. That's good, and it tastes like strawberries. Back home, it's Thursday. So tomorrow is Friday. This is really, really good. I've had quite a few messages on... Uh, uh, Instagram and on my YouTube, in the comments on my YouTube videos that you guys are enjoying the music. I use this, um, I'm subscribed to a channel called NCS, it's no copyright sounds, it's, they've got so much really cool music, so that's where I use most of my, that's how I, I, most of the music in my videos is from NCS, and it's, I'm like currently just looking for new music from them that I can just put in my, in my videos, so yeah. Check them out if you haven't already. Happy Friday. Not only is it Friday, it is May the 4th. So it's official Star Wars day today. So may the 4th be with you and all that stuff. <laughs> There's no flounder bag by the way at Primark. I'm gonna go straight to work so I can leave early. If I start early, I can leave early. It's Friday and I wanna finish as soon as possible. I totally forgot to go to the Disney store. So, yeah, they're doing Star Wars stuff tomorrow. What's my fringe doing? I did go to Forever 21 though, and I picked up a couple of tops. Not very exciting, I know, but still. Craig and I are now walking down middle of Oxford Street. Literally middle of Oxford Street. To Tottenham Court Road, and then it's home time for Friday drinks. There's a bus. And, yeah, let's get this three-day weekend started. Since today is Star Wars Day, I stopped by Donut Time on Shaftesbury Avenue. I think it's Shaftesbury Avenue, I'm not sure. So Donut Time originated in Australia and it, they've just moved over here. So they're really, really nice donuts. Some of them are a bit questionable. They've got like fried bugs on them and stuff, which is very Australian. 
But yeah, so these ones are Star Wars themed, so I'm gonna open them up and you can see. G'day, mate. Well, no, it says G'day, UK. That was a terrible Aussie accent. Hey guys. Oh, okay, so this is the Yoda one. Come on. Yeah, it's like a little Yoda with some ears and wrinkles and stuff. Yoda donut. And this one is the chewy one. This is a little Chewbacca donut. Very tasty looking. So, yes. Donut time. But I'm not going to eat these now because I just had a Chinese and I am full. Happy Saturday, it's DC day. So Craig and I are heading to the DC exhibition at the O2. We're gonna check this out and see what it's like. I'm hopeful it's good and full of Wonder Woman. We're here at the O2. I don't, um, it's there, somewhere. <laughs> and that's where we're going, that's where it is. They've got a dinosaur exhibition on as well at the moment. Very nice day. I'm glad it's a good day. We're gonna spend it all inside this O2 arena. No, we're not, we're gonna leave and enjoy the sun. DC exhibition, Dawn of Superheroes, is where we're heading. It's gonna be fun. That was a special offer I got. Two for 30. Good. The seasons come and go like thoughts of you. Like a wave returns to the sea into the blue. They change, but in a cycle that I can't lose. Each painful but delightful to live through. So far, so good. I mean, we're just going up the escalators to get in. It's so quiet. DC exhibition, Dawn of Superheroes. <laughs>
inside so I took as many pictures as I possibly could so hopefully there's there's some good stuff in there for you guys and now we're in the gift shop so yeah I like all this Wonder Woman stuff <gasps> the mascara bollock the mascara the, the mascara the mascara yeah volleyball team how much 16. that's not that bad Yep, I'm in Wonder Woman merchandise heaven right now. I'm getting it. <laughs> but look at all this stuff. This is a lot of stuff. I like the colors. DC superhero girls. <laughs> Kind of questionable. It it needs some work. She looks a little bit like a drag queen, <laughs> but I'm sure with like some help. <laughs> DC superheroes exhibition was cool. It's it's there. We're finished now. I like the woman, Wonder Woman stuff best. So yeah, that's good. If you love DC and if you love. Batman and like the history of Batman and all the costumes and everything that's the type of thing you're gonna absolutely love if you want tickets to the DC Dawn of Superheroes exhibition I'll put the links in the description down below it's running until the something of September this year so you've got plenty of time we're leaving the O2 behind and we're starting on whatever the hell we're doing next we decided on Liverpool Street so we've come to Liverpool Street and we're gonna head over to Brick Lane that's where we are now well we're not there yet we're, we're on our way there I'm really surprised how quiet it is for a Saturday. <laughs> it's very dead on Brick Lane today. Which is odd. We're in a shop for, called Atika in Brick Lane and they're giving out like free Malibu. They're making it like a party weekend vibe thing going on. It's really cool. They got like homemade vintage stuff, which is cool. I like this shop. They've got like a Spice Girls vintage tea. Free punch. It's good. Mm. Very good.
I got too hot in my sweater, so I just bought this. And I think it's quite nice. It's like massively oversized because it's from the 90s. But it is like actual Ralph Lauren. So, yay! Nice vintage stuff. only five to nine on Saturday and I'm getting into bed I'm really tired I was up till like I want to say one last night watching the uh, life and deaths of Robert Durst such a good show really really good really interesting if you're into crime stuff so yeah I was watching that last night and also RuPaul's Drag Race and the Vixen <laughs> I'm so over the Vixen I don't know I have no time for that now. Mm -mm 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 -mm. What do you think about the big sin? What do you, who's your favorite drag race star this season? Who do you want to win? Let me know in the comments below. I don't really know who I want to win. Eureka has actually grown on me. Anyway, enough of that. I'm gonna get some sleep, I'm tired. Good night. It's another smoothie day today. So I have spinach, mango and mixed berries. And I'm just gonna add my lacto-free milk. That should be enough, and then the rest can be water, so it's not too ice creamy. It's Sunday and we're heading into Portobello Road today. I'm re-wearing this that I bought yesterday, but I was only wearing it for like an hour until I got home. So it's still clean, it's fine. I mean, it's vintage, so it's probably not even clean. Oh, this is not looking good for me. I've got my Pandora and my Camellia, mostly Camellia, and yeah, here we go. Some parts of Portobello Road are really like boutique-y and cute and the rest of it's all the market. We're in the boutique bit, on the street with the colorful houses. saying how if he lived in one of these houses he would terrorize all of these sort of people who were standing outside the front posing. He would literally just water balloons, shout out the window. <laughs> I was about to swear, I'm not gonna swear. <laughs> Terrible. I love Hummingbird Bakery. We're not going in though. There's like antique markets and stuff. It's quieter today, it's Sunday. Last time I came here was a Saturday, so this was all filled with stools and everything so it's a lot more chilled and calm today it's nice I found all you can eat Thai it's really good food I love Thai food mm. I feel kind of bad. I came into the shop and asked about the manicure, the wood thing on the wearing so he's getting it off for me. So, yay. We're done in Port Bella Road because we've eaten our food. We're all full. We're gonna go find a park to sit in. That'll be a nice way to spend the rest of this Sunday. Not sure how this happens every time I go out with Craig and Craig's mum, but we end up at Speaker's Corner. So we're heading to... <laughs> The speaker's corner in Hyde Park right now. <sighs> Interesting. Hyde Park is really, really nice. Really nice. It's so sunny. I think it's like 25 degrees right now. So this is like bliss, absolute bliss. <laughs>
time. It's been a nice day. We're back from our day out in London and I'm going to give these a go. These are the Minnie Mouse eye mask things. I got these from Topshop and they are five pounds at Topshop and they are by Mad Beauty. So let's see if these like wake up my eyes. Get rid of these bags. So you have to start on a freshly washed dry face. My face has been washed and it is dry. And okay then. <laughs> Yes, so my face <laughs> has been washed and it is dry. Let's give these a go. <laughs> you can have Mickey Mouse on your eyes. No. Minnie Mouse. Oh, Minnie Mouse. How do I remove, so let's remove them. Okay, so you need scissors to open these. minutes and I've been struggling the ma majority of this time trying to keep them on my eyes so there we go I'm not too overwhelmed by them because they're too difficult to keep on my eyes but the face masks are great it's bank holiday Monday so it's the end of the weekend today and I'm going to go and have some brunch with my mum so that's how I'm gonna end this but my mum never really appears in these videos so I'm going to include her so we are in a little cafe called Belgique and we're here for brunch and this is my mum. What's your name? Where'd you come from? <laughs> What's your name? Where'd you come from? She doesn't get it. She has no name and she has no location. <laughs> and they're laughing at me because they think it's weird. It's not weird. It's an introduction. This is my weekly vlog. My name is Mum. Hi. <laughs> She's not playing along. <laughs> Craig got the sea breeze, which is crab. Crab and crab. Poor Sebastian. And we got the salmon. Mum got the salmon, I got the salmon. That's one for you. Thank you. Thanks. Ooh, look at this food. Nom, nom, nom. We're now waving off my mum, and this is the end of my weekly vlog, so I hope you've enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, like and subscribe, and all that stuff. My mum likes it. <laughs> you should like it too. <laughs> What's your name? Where'd you come from? <laughs>